Put that in today, brother. Mullet. Mullet. Tapos trim lang sa likod. Yung taas. Ponti lang. J. Name and... Ilan taong mo na, bro? Current, ano mo, brother? Current, uh... Current occupation mo. Civil engineer. Mm. Was working for telecom company. Sa Huawei. Matagal ka na doon, bro? For, ano, magpa four years. So, being a civil engineer, bro, dyan sa company niyo, ano yung mga naging unang challenges mo? Hindi ngayon. Ito more on culture. Culture? Yeah, okay. So, well, kasi most of my supervisors are Chinese. Ah. So, so adjustments? Very, ano sila, um, hardworking, persistent. Wow. Over time, very common. Yeah. Ano man napulot mo dun? Probably, ano, Waking to the problems, finding solutions, how you handle your mga problems. Maraming laging issues and challenges. So pretty much almost self-growth na rin nangyari sa during In your work field, ano mga current struggles mo ngayon? Personally, same pa rin naman eh. Kasi right now, dealing ako more on project management. Mm -hmm. So how you handle yung mga issues, everyday issues na parang blockage sa project mo. Yeah. Finding solutions. Yung pa rin natin. Nice. Pero syempre yung approach mo ngayon and that is way different na, no? Yeah. More, more relaxed. Mm -hmm. Don't panic. Yeah. Anong mga techniques mo, bro? Pag na-stress ka or na-overwhelm ka sa trabaho? Breathe. Breathe? Yes. As simple as that, di ba? Sometimes, minsan, pag nagpapanik ka, nakakalimutan mong mag-inhale, exhale. Lalo ko nagpapanik eh. Yes. Take your mind off of that tapos yeah. balik ka rin. Yeah, that's a good one. Breathe. Yeah. Breathe. <laughs> sa mga papasok sa ganyang industry bro, what can you give them as uh, advice? If papasok ka na lang yung telecom, be prepared na <laughs> kasi very hectic talaga sa telecom industry. Yeah. Very demanding. Anong goal mo brother? in where you're at right now? Personally, kasi yung work, hindi ko siya treat as my life. Parang it's a means for me. Yes. To avail the things that I want, to do the things that I want. Mm -hmm. So, end goal, to have enough money to invest somewhere so okay. that I don't have to work yeah. anymore. Ano yung wrong expectation mo na napapunta ka sa, sa industry mo? Civil engineering in general. Yeah. One of the expectations, mataas yung sa salary. Yes. But in general, sobrang ang baba ng salary for civil engineers. Yes. So, even nung after namin mag-boards, parang mismo namin, dapat sir, itong engineering na yung kinuha namin para yeah. mataas yung starting salary. Yeah. So, doon naging lucky na lang ako na for... Kasi yung telecom, parang very... Few lang yung civil engineers na pumupunta sa telco industry. Ah, that's true. Yes. What kept you holding on? Kasi ngayon, three years ka na, di ba? Mm. Yeah. Compensation. Compensation. Yeah. I mean, you can't blame that. I mean, if if you're you're being paid good, yeah, di ba? Kasi wala eh. Everything yeah. is bought by money. Yeah. Money makes the world go around. Yeah. Kahit sabihin mo na. Yeah. Hindi. Pero no. in reality. It's, yeah. Bro, you need money, bro. <laughs> oh, iba, bro. Yeah, to survive, you need money. To eat, you need money. It's for everything, there's money. So, ang hirap isipin na one sickness away ka lang from poverty. Since nasa Manila ka na, isa ka na lang pumunta dito. Our app is coming out. Feb 28, yung Babsa. Yung Boca mm -hmm. Barber style. With you speaking about your crazy schedule, plus your life na... You think it's gonna help you out? Pag may ganun ng app. Tulad ng app na lalabas namin. Yeah. Very convenient. Um, one booking only. And if you mind me asking, bro, pala, how much do you usually spend now for haircuts in Manila? 500. 500. Okay, yes. our app, our app kasi is gonna start at 300. Mm -hmm. Standard price. Pero yung mga barbers, sila yung may right mag price, depende sa how much they wanna charge uh -huh. and then the quality they can provide. So our app is a uh, star rating system, siya. So before pa dumating yung barbero sa yun, napili mo na kung sino yung gusto mo talaga. Um, makikita mo yung portfolio nila, makikita mo yung rating ng mga other clients. And not just that, 
also barber shops can sign up dun sa app. What do you expect from ano naman brother? If you're if you're gonna avail it on Feb 28, it's free to download. If you're gonna use it, what do you expect from barbers that you're gonna book? Um, quality. Yeah. I expect na very accommodating, so they have to go to your house. That's true. And then one thing that we can secure also is the safety of the client. Yeah. Every barber that's going to sign up with this app, brother, is um, has an NBA clearance, police clearance, valid ID. Then on top of that, the barber that you brought to you will with a QR code. Every barber has a pure, uh, personalized QR code that you need to scan to confirm that that's the uh, barber that you bought. Yeah. So how does that feel as a client? Makes me feel safe. Safe. Since yeah. I'm letting them inside my life. Yes. Siyempre, that's one thing that we thought about also. Papasok yung random na tao sa bahay ng client. At least you have to feel secure mm. na okay yung barber from the startup. Then, upon arriving, alam mo talaga yun yung barber na bin. Feb 28, bro. Sana masupport tayo. Go <laughs> download. Available. Feb 28 on iOS and Play Store. Ah, kanil. Yeah. Yeah. I took off a little bit bulk dito sa likod. Alright, my bro. Thank you so much. I'm sorry. Ingat ka, brother. Ha?